Oh god, is that a six? Oh my gosh! We got a six! Oh! What the heck, PSA? Remember when I sent my most valuable cards to PSA? Well, it has finally arrived, everybody. Look at this from Golden Auctions via PSA. Last time I was at the Dallas Card Show, I submitted my Eddie Guerrero Gold and a variety of other amazing sports cards in my collection to PSA at the Golden Booth. And now it has finally returned. Just to give you guys a time frame, the, this actually was ready about four weeks ago or six weeks ago. So it took about a month and change for this to get done. I just hadn't had a chance to return it and I didn't want this to be sitting in my PO box while I was gone. I wanted to have it. I don't know about you guys, but I'm very protective when it comes to certain things. And this is like a PSA order is a big deal, especially of this and some of my favorite cards are in here. So without further ado, I am going to do this. I'm going to open this up and guys, if you can comment down below, what is like one card from PSA that you guys are waiting for. Here we go. I've been looking forward to this for a while, so very excited. And one else thing crazy, the Dallas Card Show is this week in literally three days, and I can take all this inventory with me to Dallas. The timing on this is impeccable, and I just gotta say, I am so excited right now. Here we go. All right. Oh, my first PSA submission of the year, and it's literally in this box right here. Look at this mailer. I have to do it. You guys ready? Not as loud as I, you would think. All right, it's in here, everybody. This is it. All right, I say we go one by one. I have no idea what the grades are. I'm so nervous. I am so nervous. Oh my, oh my gosh, here it is. All right, look, look, this is so epic. Oh. All right, here's the deal. I'm gonna go one by one and show you guys these cards. All right, everybody, look at this. Should we start from the bottom or the top? I see Tom Brady. Actually, we're upside down. This might be better. It'll be more interesting. All right, I see a Tom Brady out of 149. I'm gonna let you guys see it first. This is the first card from the submission. This is a white Premier Select level. I remember submitting this card. Here we go. Oh no, it's a blue. Tom Brady blue. Can you guys see it? And let's see what we got. PSA 10, oh my gosh, okay, sick. This is so sick, out of 149, I bought this in a lot, and uh, just a cool looking card, Tom Brady Blue. I, ha I had had it for a while, and it is a PSA 10, our first PSA 10, so you know what, we're gonna do something different. Let's keep track of, of our grades. I'm gonna tell you at the end how many we have. Let me grab a piece of paper and a pen. 10, 9, 8, 7, and then six and below. One to our 10 category, and I'll just keep track, and I'll show you guys at the end, so here we go. All right, so, so far, so good. PSA 10, blue, Tom Brady. Okay, the Eddie Guerrero's here. Oh my gosh, I pulled this card myself when WWE Prism was $600. This is it, guys, here we go. I'm gonna show you guys first again. Eddie Guerrero, gold, I can't see it, I can't see it. And let's see, I hope it's, a, I hope it's at least a nine. Please be a nine. If it's an eight or a seven, I'm gonna scream. Oh, free, got a nine, thank God. I thought it was an eight. Eddie Guerrero gold, my first uh, WWE gold, and I pulled this myself and it got a nine. And to be honest with you guys, I'll just explain it to you on this card. I knew there was a dimple and there was a dimple right there and I knew I couldn't get a 10 and I was a little nervous to send this, but there we go. Eddie Guerrero gold and we got a PSA nine on that. So pretty cool right there. I'm still happy. It could have been worse. When you pack pull a card and, and you grade it and you think it's a 10, I wasn't confident in that with the dimple. I just didn't really explain it on video, but one nine and one 10. All right, here we go. Let's go to the next card. We got a Jalen Green. Jalen Green. And here it is. PSA nine on the Jalen Green. Wow. Okay. PSA nine. Nice Jalen Green right there. I do gotta ask you guys, that Victor Webanyama guy, where do you guys think he's gonna go? Pick his team down below, I'm very curious. He could be on our, he could be on the Rockets, the Spurs, the, the Hornets. Pulled this myself, I pulled this myself. I'll let you guys see. Anthony Davis, or Anthony Davis, Anthony Edwards, rookie, auto out of 99. Here we go. Oh, got a nine, I pulled this myself. And, and Anthony Edwards, he like signs off the sticker, which is super irritating sometimes, but um, this one got a nine, which, I, yeah, I could see the corners are kind of soft. Got a nine on that, so that's all right. And Anthony Edwards. 
Three nines and only one ten. And dang, we gotta get some more tens. All right, next one's a Dejounte Murray. Hawks were disappointing this year, but here we go to one ninety nine. The orange. I've had it for a minute. All right. Oh, got a nine. All right, it's better than an eight or a seven. The orange rookie out of one ninety nine. Dejounte Murray got a nine. Good. Right there. Yeah, that's four nines. You gotta get some tens. Next one's a Luis Robert. I'll let you guys see it. Luis Robert blue. And that is out of 499. And that got a nine. So paper. It's a paper Bowman. Luis Robert. Not sure what he's doing right now, but uh, it's a nine. Oh, we have a gold out of 10. 10 of 10. I bought this in uh, Dallas last time. Come on. Come on. Give it to me. I'll let you guys see it. Malik Willis gold rookie. All right, you guys, tell me tell me in the comments, did I get a 10, did I get a 10, or a nine? Give me a nine. Oh, we got a 10, yes! I know Malik Willis, they just drafted a quarterback, but to get a gold 10, sick. Malik Willis, PSA 10, I bought this in Dallas, and that is a gold 10 of 10 from Behind the Numbers Gold Zenith Football 2022. So nice looking card right there, it looks really great. Oh, we got a Tom Brady coming up, here we go. Tom Brady, and I'll mix it up halfway through. Actually, no, I'll just keep going. Tom Brady, is this the white? The white select. Come on, give us a 10. All right, I'm gonna look at the camera, ready? Yes, my Brady's got 10s, I bought these. I was so happy, I looked these through too. White prism select out of 35, the short print, Tom Brady. So nice little Brady's from Select, PSA 10 right there. I was looking over these and I was really waiting and waiting and waiting to submit them and I finally took them in and uh, there we go. Shout out to PSA, shout out to Golden. Nice, all right, we're on the board. That We have three tens and we have four nines. So Kyle Trask, is it a gold? No, okay, I know what this is. All right, let's see, Kyle Trask. Oh God, is that a six? Oh my gosh, we got a six. Oh, dude, I'm sorry, I didn't even slow reveal. I was so em embarrassed. What? How did this get a six? It was so well centered. Oh my gosh, maybe I'm off. PSA six, orange laser of Kyle Trashmaster. What the heck? Are you kidding me? It got a six. What the heck, PSA? I'm shooketh. Oh, PSA six on this? Man, why is this a six? Somebody tell me, what am I missing? Darn it, okay. Okay, six and below. We're gonna add that to the category. It literally says it right there. <laughs> Did not expect that, all right. Next up, this is a cool one. This is a Spike Lee auto. I'll show you guys first and I, I'll take a look. Oh, I see that from here, it's a 10. Spike Lee. Allen and Ginter on card autograph. One of the best directors, in my opinion. Spike Lee on card auto, PSA 10 right there. And we got a 10. Yes, super happy about this. On card auto, Spike Lee 10. That adds some value to it. I bought a bunch of these raw. So to get a 10 on this, it definitely adds value. And uh, pretty happy about that. So I was holding on to the Spike Lees for a while. Raheem Sterling. Raheem Sterling Gold. Right there. I wish it was Rashford. All right, what'd we get? Oh my gosh. I got a seven. I got a seven. I got a seven on this? Two out of 10? What? The corners look great. Centering looks decent too. Dude, this is, oh my gosh, I see it. Oh my, I am blind, everybody. That corner is done. Raheem Sterling Gold, PSA 7. So much for the gold PC. Look at that. PSA 7. This corner is so horrible. I don't know. I missed it on that. It's flipped up. I didn't see that when I submitted it. Dang. All right. That's a 7, then. It's our first 7. Dang. Okay. We've got a Spike Lee. All right. I'm going to let you guys see. Also, I'm going to look too. Fine. I'm peeking. Ooh, it's a nine. Dang, okay, Spike Lee, we got a nine on this one. Still pretty good, I know what I paid into these, so PSA nine right there. Spike Lee auto, 
then pick it up. Uh, just culture cards like this, really cool. Very influential. Spike Lee, PSA 9. And that's cool, that's fine. I got a 10 on the one, and I think there should be one more in here. So to get a nine on that, very happy about that. So a Spike Lee on-card autograph for the win. I love I love the that Topps is adding uh, people like that into the product, it's so cool. All right, so we're up to nine, we're, we're up to five nines. All right, next up we got a Joe Mixon gold vinyl, I think. I'm gonna let you guys see, I'm not gonna look, I'm not gonna look, it's a gold vinyl, I'm not looking. Gold vinyl, and it is numbered four out of five. I bought this raw. Yes, we got a 10, oh my gosh. There's no better feeling than buying a raw card from somebody and knowing that you could potentially send it to grading and it comes back a 10. Name a better feeling. Oh my gosh, thank you, PSA. Thank you, PSA, for blessing me. Heck yeah, okay, so we're up, we're tied up. Uh, no, we're not, we have four 10s, all right. So we've submitted a total of 11 cards so far. Let's keep going. We've got a one of one. My Carl Towns one of one. All right, I got a cheat here. I'm just gonna show it. This is like opening sports cards. Please, 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 please give me a 10. Please give me a 10, please give me a 10. Oh no, it's, small, it's a small number. I can't really read it. Carl Towns Black Prism, I haven't seen it. It looks like a nine or an eight. Oh my gosh, hopefully it's not a seven. I'll lose my mind. All right, what did we get? Oh, it's a nine, I'll take it, okay. Gosh darn it, I thought it was gonna be a 10. I really was confident on this one. Carl Towns, Black Prism, one of one. It's a true one of one. And uh, we got a one, we got a PSA nine on it. So still good, I'm happy with it. I'd rather get a, I mean, tell me the truth. I'd rather get a nine than get like a seven or an eight or something, sheesh, oh gosh. All right, we'll add it to the nine, so. All right, we're on a roll, let's keep going. Next one's another one of one. Come on, I'm going for the straight reveal. Jeremiah Robinson Earl, it's a die cut. Die cuts are very tough to grade. It's a true one of one rookie black prism. And we've got, oh, a PSA nine on this. That's all right. One of one. Die cuts are tough to grade. I, in my opinion, die cuts are the toughest cards besides national treasures and these thick jersey cards to grade, so. Uh, to get a nine on a die cut, I'm actually very impressed. So, Jeremiah Robinson Earl, nice looking card. Kind of looking at it, um, can't really tell you what's. Eh, you know what? It's look at the edges. I mean, that's a tough. That's a tough card to grade right there. So, it's all right. All right, let's keep going. Got a Kyle Trask again. Here we go. Trask Auto. I don't know if he's gonna play, to be honest with you, because Baker is playing. At a 99, Kyle Trask, and we got a, oh my. Dude, that was a card I thought was gonna be a 10, actually. I am in shock. Are you kidding me? Ah, oh, centering's bad from top to bottom. You ever, you ever like, in your mind when you're submitting, you're like, oh, this is gonna be, they're all gonna be 10s, and you look at it now, and you're like, all right, maybe PSA got this one right. Top to bottom's bad on this. Top to bottom, look at that. It's like a thin line and like a thick, look how thick and thin. So, it's all right. All right, next up, they just got knocked out of the playoffs, but it's a gold out of 10. The MVP of this year's National Basketball Association, Joel Embiid. Gold checkered, one out of 10. I haven't looked at the grade, I'm gonna look. Come on, bless me. Yes, this got a 10, the MVP, baby. The Sixers uh, unfortunately lost, Tatum went off. Speaking of Tatum, what up? Um, gold, select company gold out of 10. One out of 10, beautiful, Joel Embiid. So it's a great card to bring to a show and I'm very excited about that. So gold out of 10. Shout out to all my Sixers fans out there. Bill Graffs, Matt Heck, Stedman, Prestige Bulls, and everybody else. All right, next up, got a Jason Tatum. This is one of the white sparkles. These are the white sparkle packs. Jason Tatum white sparkle, these are out of 25, but they're not numbered. It's a PSA. Dang, okay, got a nine. I was confident about these. Jason Tatum white sparkle, still got a nine, that's still cool. Tatum, I picked these up at the Dallas show. Added the Embiid in that, so we're at seven to five right now on the nines and the tens. We're getting, we're getting close, evening out. Next up, we got another white sparkle. Drew Holiday. 
Drew Holiday kind of got lit up in the playoffs, but uh, PSA 10. We got a 10. All right, six to seven. We're almost, if I can get more tens and nines, it's awesome, but we'll see. Here we go. Jaw Morant. This is, an, a, this is a tough guy, tough situation. Jaw Morant. I'll ask this because the card's John Morant. What do you guys think is going to happen there? I think um, he uh, he's going to get suspended, but I think from a educational just like thing, he needs to he needs to surround himself around some different people, and uh, he really needs to get uh, get some support. That's like he needs to have some better better people around him, and he needs to get his get his act together. I mean, that's the only way to say it. That's the only way I could say it. John Morant. Oh, stained glass got a 10. Okay. Mosaic stained glass, John Morant. PSA 10 right there. So I hope Jaw gets the help he needs. I really like him a lot the way he plays. I just I wish he would just get it together. Stained glass 10. Very nice looking card right there. Beautiful, beautiful. So it's another 10. All right. 10s and 9s are tied. 20 out of 75. George Russell. Pink wave. Guy looks like a beast. And it got a nine. Okay. So 20 out of 75, George Russell. Who's your guys' favorite F1 racer? If you guys have one, put it down below. Shout out to C. Blaise, aka Chad. I know he PCs this guy, and this is 80 out of 99. Franz Wagner, blue. And it got a 10. I can see it from here. It looks good on the camera. Franz Wagner, we got a 10 on that one. There we go, Franz Wagner, we got a 10. Nice looking card. So it's another 10. Okay, so the 10s are tied. Look at this, we're in a race, eight to eight on 10s and nines. Legit, it's a legit race here. All right, next up, this is a gold out of 10. 10 out of 10, Bruce Brown. I overpaid so bad on this card when he was balling. Bruce Brown gold, got a nine. I can see it from here and I'm not happy. I am relieved. Thought this was gonna get a eight or a seven. Bruce Brown, nice gold auto, gold rookie, true rookie gold. And that got a nine right there. So, pretty cool. Bruce Brown, gold nine. All right, so the nines are in the lead and we have two cards left. 179 out of 299, Jalen Brunson, who balled out this year for New York. We got a red wave and it is a low number. It doesn't look like a 10 to me. This is the red, not the wave, the red prism. True red rookie. And it got a nine. Dang. He's, he was played so well this year for New York. Jalen Brunson was so fun to watch. I like him a lot. He's a cool, cool player. All right, last card. Pretty much the nines took over because they have 10 nines and uh, eight tens. So here we go. Last card. Shea, Gilgis Alexander, White Sparkle. Yeah, I'm assuming it got a nine, but let's see. And it got a nine. All right, so there's only two. So just to recap here, there's only two disappointments. So there was a total of 11 nines. Actually, I'll go down the list. There was eight tens. There was a total number of 11 of the PSA nines. There was one eight, one seven, and one six and below. So not bad, not bad at all for the submission, and I'm very happy with it. Uh, shout out to PSA, shout out to Golden. I haven't submitted cards in a while, so for me to start submitting again, this is fun. I, I actually really enjoyed it. I love submitting cards. I was submitting so much during COVID for PSA. I was going crazy with that stuff, so to get my cards back, I'm very happy. Can't wait to submit some more. Uh, PSA is actually gonna be in Dallas this week, so I actually might drop off some more cards to them. I'm very interested to see what I have in my raw pile. I have some stuff right here to my left, so need to need to sort all that out and get ready for the Dallas Card Show. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like. Don't forget to comment down below. Please subscribe. I just wanna say thank you so much for watching. As always, talk to you guys for the next video. See you guys.